Uh, hi, I'm Brayson Natto. I'm in uh, eight, eighth grade, and I'm at McTavish. Uh, and today we're gonna ask some cops some questions. So, this is the cop. And I'm uh, Staff Sergeant Graham Gursky of the Wood Buffalo RCP Detachment. But for this, you can call me Graham. I'm gonna call you Officer. That works. Whatever you want. Okay, you ready? I'm ready to go. Okay. Let's do this. What does each one of those pouches, like, hold? So, the ones on my vest here? Like, everyone. Everything? Well, that is naloxone spray, that is a tourniquet, and those are my carbine rifle magazines, which is ammunition. I have another question. Are you going to arrest me? Absolutely not. But I brought these guns to school. <laughs> well, in that case, I might have to. Okay, okay. Now, here's the big question, okay? How many times have you been in a high-speed chase? Oh, I have 18 years service this summer, and I can't remember because it's been a few. So, more than you could count? Probably more than I could count. How many times have, have you had to use your gun? I have never had to use my gun. Oh, I'm so sorry for that. Oh, that's depressing. Uh, what does, what is your favorite, uh, police code? And what does it mean? What is my favorite police code? Ah, uh, 1075, which is meal break time. Ah. That's, the, that's the important one. Is it true all cops like donuts? Uh, believe it or not, that's not true. Some don't. Yeah. I've been lied to my whole life? Yeah, not true. Not true, sadly. For cops, like cop school, right? Is that a thing, right? Like cop the, school, like sure. the academy, the academy, sure. right? Right, right. I think that's a thing, right? It is a thing. Yeah. Okay. Okay. In, like there, do you have to like run laps and stuff? Like get like jacked? Uh, yeah. Physical training and uh, daily exercise and and running as a group and whatnot with your class. Yeah, that that is a thing. Yeah, every day you're there. You have to do that. How was the food whilst you were there? Uh, you know what? It wasn't bad, actually. So we go to training in Regina. Every RCP officer that's trained is there, and it's actually not bad, I must say. I didn't mind it. Really? Yeah, they switched up every day. You know, you might have a burger one day, pizza the next, ah. maybe turkey the next. Yeah, so they're, like they're pretty good at giving us some variety, yeah. Yeah, that sounds like a... You'd probably like the food there. Yeah, yeah. Exactly. yeah. You know when the sirens are going off? When you're like trying to get somewhere, why would you do that? Like, wouldn't they like, wouldn't they know that you're coming if you hear if they hear the wee woo wee woo? Yeah, I mean, uh, if we gotta go get somewhere really quick, you gotta you gotta turn the lights on and the sirens. Just be loud, tell people to get out of the way. There's an emergency. We gotta get somewhere. But then wouldn't the guy like the criminal hear that and then like no? It, de it depends what it is. I mean, if we're uh, getting close to, say, uh, somebody breaking in in progress, we're going to turn those sound off right before we get there so that they don't know we're coming right there. Yeah. Okay. Now, why are the lights blue and red? That's just uh, what common police colors are in Canada, North America, actually. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Why do you get to run red lights? Well, if we have a, uh, a legal reason to do so, like we got to stop somebody, then uh, the law enables police to do that. We have an okay. exemption for that. But we have to use it with specific reason. We can't just, okay. I can't just drive to Tim Hortons and uh, run the red. Yeah, that, that doesn't fly. What? No, sadly, no. <sighs> That's depressing. I wish you could. Like, Tim Hortons and, like, right. yeah. Yeah, no, oh, yeah. That, uh, wouldn't fly, unfortunately. Wouldn't fly? No, mm -hmm. no. Okay, what is the fastest a cop car can go? Uh, it depends. I mean, depends on the model, but I mean, you can get up to 170, close to 200 kilometers per hour. Uh, you know the speedometer thing, right? Like when you hide there and then you do that and then you see how fast people go. What yeah. was the fastest you've seen somebody go? Fastest I've seen personally. Yeah. Probably 160 in a in a city street. It's pretty fast. That's Dangerous fast. Dangerous fast, yeah. What car was it? It was like a sports car. Ah, yeah. 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 What mo like what brand are cop cars? Like. Oh, 
we have a few. I mean, we use Fords, uh, Chevys. We, yeah, there's a few, few in our fleet, few different kinds. Yeah. Are motorcycle cops in Fort McMurray, or is it too like icy and stuff? Uh, well, I mean, RCP and Alberta have motorcycle police, but not specifically here. Yeah, uh -huh. there's no, there's no like bike squad here. Okay. Like, for that, yeah. What do you think? Like, do you think police are underpaid? Yes or no? <laughs> my uh, my salary is is actually pretty good, good I must say. Good. So what about the benefits? We have excellent benefits. Yeah. Actually, do you have dental? It's all covered. Dent dental, yep. Whatever you need, they look after us pretty good. I must say. What about massages? That is covered too. Oh my God, you yeah. guys have a life. <laughs> That's not fair. Okay, what, like, what type of boots do you guys have? We got, uh, there's a few different models, but um, they're basically your just generic kind of black ankle boot like that. They're not, this isn't steel toe, but it's kind of a flexible okay. work, work boot, yeah. Is there a special store you have to go to to get your, like, outfit, or? Well, I mean, this is all provided to us. It's okay. all key issue, yeah. So, I mean, no, I like I don't go buy it. No. Do you have your handcuffs on you currently? I do. Yes. Mm -hmm. After for duty. Okay. Okay. Have you ever used them, like your handcuffs, like to what's it called to? contain somebody and throw them into your car and then drive like to arrest yeah that that's the word i'm looking for i, I have yes many times what number oh, over, over, over the course of 18 years i i couldn't give you a number grace and many times yeah uh how many stakeouts have you been on also too many too many to, to probably give you an accurate number. what is the best stakeout food mm, i don't know maybe maybe pizza Maybe Joma's pizza. Mm. Me personally, I would have said steak, like steak mm, out. That would, for... be, that would be a good one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. clever, like play on words. Like... Yeah, I like I like your train of thought there. Yeah, yeah. like like get get it like. Mm -hmm. See where you're going. Yeah. Okay, how many like so for a stakeout? Do you have to go into like an undercover car or like just a plain police car? Uh, it really depends what you're doing. It depends what, what the operation is. It could be either or. Either or? Have mm. you ever been into an undercover police car? I have been in a... What do they look like? All different kinds. Not, not one specific kind. <laughs> Dang it. I wanted to know that just so then I could look out for them. Like, if you're in there, do you still have to wear your uniform? It really depends what you're doing. Peace out. Pleasure, Grayson. Anytime. You do a good handshake. I'm not even going to lie there. Like, you do a <laughs> real good handshake. <laughs> All right.